waiting for dad to get back so we can head out. It's a uh, Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Um, we, what are we doing today? Taking paychecks up the shop. Just talked to my cousin Ronnie, the one I'm in business with. He's in New Jersey. He flew out there this morning at like 6.30. Uh, there's a truck out there he was interested in. And I just called him and he's on his way home. Uh, driving that truck, said truck. So he, uh, what we did is he just, he got a bank check and wrote it out out of our account. And then we're going to get a, a loan to put that money back in our account. But, um. He said so far, it's driving nice. He's in some mountains. He's going to spend the night in Pennsylvania. No, Pittsburgh. Yeah, that's Pennsylvania. He said, I'm going to get me a Philly cheesesteak. <laughs> and, uh, not, that would be Philadelphia where the Philly cheesesteak is. He said he was getting some in Pittsburgh. Steak sandwich? Something? I don't know. Uh, the people who are doing Wiener Palooza, I finally got them to send me this little flyer. There's three on a page. I want to slice them up. I want to print out a few and maybe set them at places. Maybe like a dog groomers or pet stores or whatever um, for a little advertising. Wiener Palooza. There's the information. It is a fun time. Very fun time. Uh... I am brain dead. Just talked to my accountant. Her husband just got done doing uh, radiation five days a week for the last, I don't know how many weeks, a couple weeks. And then they're going to have him start this new therapy on Friday. It's not chemo, but it's a, a therapy for his immune system. I don't know. Apparently he um, qualified to do this certain thing. So he starts out on Friday. She said today he's feeling a little bit better over the weekend. He did not feel good. He was using his walker, was pretty weak, but today he's feeling a little better. Uh, it's kind of a day by day thing. So I'm supposed to call her early next week and she's gonna walk me through something on my QuickBooks. She's uh, finishing up my taxes. Cause whenever I call her and she answers, I'm like, is this a good time? Cause if it's not, I'll call back another time. I'm always afraid to call cause I don't know if they're gonna be in the hospital. They're gonna have you know, it's just, it's, it's a sad situation. Tomorrow, I think I'm going to go see Spider-Man. Spider-Man. It's a lot. I think it's the last day. It might be there next week again, just for a couple. Like right now, this week, it's only there like two times a day, like at 3.30 and like 8. Uh, I think it's doing it again next week, and then it'll be gone. So it's probably on one of the small screens back in the corner. But I don't care. I want to see it. I think it's gonna happen tomorrow. Then Friday's back to the pool. Man, yesterday, after the pool, my body was like jello. I was in the pool for like two and a half hours, and um, and my prediction was right. Yesterday was kids' day at the fair, and I'm like, and they have open swim an hour before class. So I always go an hour before class. A lot of times there's a bunch of kids during the summer because, you know, they're not in school. No kids yesterday. They were all at the fair. We had three like teenage girls come in for maybe 30 minutes. No kids. It was so peaceful in there. It was glorious. But I bet you the, the fair was hopping. It was hot though. It was hot. It was like 91, 92. That's warm for here. I know some of y'all have the triple digits. I am so sorry for you. I could not do it. I got my AC on because it's warm and humid. I just like the humidity out of the air. It makes my body feel a tiny bit better than the humidity. I think today I'm going to take dad to a new place. I have not been there. He has not been there. I have seen somebody talk about it. On a, I'm on a couple like food critics places for area, our area and someone talked about it yesterday and I've driven by it many times and I've always said I want to stop and try it. And um, they do Mexican food and they do West Indian food. And um, but a lot of the, some of the stuff they only make on Thursdays and Fridays that are special dishes, like they guess they do a snapper fish on Thursday and Friday, and they do some different curries and things on Thursday and Friday, but I mainly want to try the wet burrito, I think. 
I'm not 100% sure. But I think that's where I'm going to take them. It's in Little Town of Berrien Springs. They have, supposedly have a market in there also, so that'd be fun to see. It's like, they have like a international market. And uh, I always like to see the produce in those kind of places, see if they have anything weird or unusual. I still would like to try durian one day. I need to go to like the Asian market to see if they have any like frozen durian. One day I will try it. Other than that, that's all that's going on today. Heidi, oh, poor Heidi. When Heidi, Heidi does not pee in the house rare. I can't remember the last time she did that. But if she has a bellyache and she has to go, number two, she'll go in the bathroom and goes in the carpet. So and a while back I bought some pads to lay down in there. And so dad laid one down in there yesterday and we went away and we came home and he goes, Heidi pooped in the bathroom. And it always looks like, like melted chocolate because... Apparently her stomach's not feeling well. And I'm like, did she get on the pad? He goes, no. Because she's never, ever dealt with kind of pads to go to the bathroom on ever. Because she's always like, tell us to go outside. And she goes outside. So she didn't get the whole concept of the puppy pad. So, yes. That was a bummer. She's done it a couple times this week, actually. But she knows the she knows the room to go into. It's funny she goes into the bathroom to do it. So, <laughs> but you can't get mad at her. She's 14 years old, and you know when you're old and you gotta go, you gotta go. There's, it, it just happens. What else is coming up? Anything happening anytime soon? I told Dad sometime soon. I want to go to the casino on a Saturday and have the seafood buffet so I can crack some crab legs and enjoy them. I haven't gone in almost two years, so it's like a very once in a, a long occasion uh, treat. And that time is coming, I told him. We were going to go this last Saturday. And I said, well, since we're meeting um, Janet and Charlie for pizza on Sunday, I'll just, we'll just cook, I'll just cook on, on Saturday. And that's when I did the ham and the vegetables. And then we'll just do it some other weekend. And yesterday, a while back, Dad had bought a can of chop suey, beef chop suey, you know, the two cans and you put the beef sauce in the thing and then you drain the vegetables, you put them in there and then you put it over rice. When I was a kid, we used to have it. And I used to like it. I made it yesterday. Easy dinner. We had some frozen egg rolls in the freezer. So we had some of those with our chop suey. I will never have that ever again. It tasted like nothing. It tastes like nothing. I just ate enough to fill my stomach and I was done. I didn't enjoy it. I told dad, I'm like, all the leftovers are yours. I'll take the egg rolls. You can have all that chop suey. I mean, it didn't taste bad, but it didn't taste like anything. I was so sad because as a kid, I remembered it. Now, no bueno. No bueno. Oh, well, I told Dad never buy this again. Never, ever, ever buy it again. I think, I think I've done everything on this sheet. <laughs> All the stuff I write down and cross off and write down and cross off. I use every corner of these things. Rip it off. This is going to last me a little while. I'll be sad when that pad's gone. I'll have to look that up on... I think she got it on Amazon and tried to uh, see if they have it on there to order another one. I use it all of the time. I know I've said that before, but I'm stressing it. I use it all the time. All right, today's just a little bit sit here and babble, waste some time waiting for Dad to get home. Yeah. My stomach's growling because I haven't had any. What time is it? It is going on 12:30, and I haven't 
I haven't eaten anything since that crappy chop suey last night. So my stomach's going. I might have to go get some peaches. We, when I went to the Y yesterday, I gave Dad some money. And I said, it's "Cause the the uh, the place we buy the donut peaches are like a few miles up the road." I said, "Would you go see if they still have donut peaches?" Cause I was out, and he's like, "Okay," and he he, he picked me up. I'm like, "Did they have them?" He's like, "Yeah, they still have them." I'm like, "Yes." So I'm all replenished on my donut peach. Mmm, they're so good. I'll have to take one to Nikki to try tomorrow when we go to the movies. Have her try it as we're driving to the movies. Okay, I'm gonna go. I've talked too long just about random crap. That'll be the name. Random crap today. I just put this shirt on so it's kind of off. See, I like these shirts to have the big pockets because I put my wallet and I, I tend to like to store things in here. And um, this is a big honking pocket. Some of my shirts have little baby pockets and I don't like it. Nothing fits in there or wants to stay. It always wants to.